So why is everyone taking Glynac, meaning glycine and NAC together, or NAC? Glynac has been shown to improve or even correct key contributors related to aging, which we're gonna talk about in this video. When we get older, things start changing, right? We experience increased oxidative stress and mitochondrial dysfunction. Now, oxidative stress can break down cell tissue and cause DNA damage, which can also result in inflammation. And these things can lead to lifelong diseases like diabetes and even cancer. Mitochondrial dysfunction can cause fatigue, weakness, and is considered a major contributing factor to diseases such as cardiovascular disease, cancer, obesity, insulin resistance, and type 2 diabetes. Now, the problem is that improving or reversing these defects has proven very, very difficult. As we get older, around our mid-40s, glutathione levels begin to go down. Glutathione is known as the master antioxidant, and lower levels of glutathione mean our bodies have a more difficult time with the detoxification process in general. And we end up with elevated levels of oxidative stress and mitochondrial dysfunction. It's one reason we start feeling tired all the time. It's harder to get up, it's harder to bend down, it's harder to go up the stairs, it's harder to stay awake, we get injured more easily, we gain weight more easily, we get sick more often, and it takes longer to recover from that sickness. Speaking of recovery, it also takes longer to recover from physical exercise or activity. Our strength, speed, and agility begin to decline, and we can just feel run down. Now, of course, everyone experiences these things in varying degrees, some sooner and some later. Now, a very exciting study was published in the Journal of Gerontology in August 2022. This was a randomized placebo-controlled clinical trial, which is like the gold standard of scientific studies. And this study was done in humans not mice. They wanted to see if supplementing Glynac in older adults would make a difference in these, in this oxidative stress and mitochondrial dysfunction, as well as other hallmarks of aging. Here's what they found. After 16 weeks of Glynac supplementation, glutathione levels increased, mitochondrial health improved, and energy increased, mitophagy improved. Now, mitophagy is the cleaning up and recycling of old mitochondria. Inflammation was also reduced, insulin resistance was reduced, and insulin sensitivity was improved. They also saw improved endothelial function. Now, endothelial cells form a very fine layer, a single cell thick that lines all of the blood vessels in your body and regulates exchanges between the bloodstream and the tissues. It also controls dilation and narrowing of blood cells or blood vessels and allows for inflammation control and the initiation of immune response. So it's extremely important that it's functioning properly. They also saw improvements in genomic health, stem cells, cellular senescence, and reduced oxidative stress. So what did the participants experience as a result of all these improvements? Increased muscle strength, increased gait speed, meaning how fast they could walk, improved blood pressure, and waist size. So in other words, they became stronger, faster, more metabolically healthy, and they lost weight. So if you're taking Glynac, please leave a comment below. I'd love to hear about your personal experience, and I'm sure it will be helpful to anybody else that sees your comment. So at the conclusion of the study, they say Glynac supplementation in older adults for 16 weeks was safe and well tolerated. By combining the benefits of glycine, NAC, and GSH, meaning glutathione, Glynac is an effective nutritional supplement that improves and reverses multiple age-associated abnormalities to promote health in aging humans. Now, let's address some common questions. Who should consider taking Glynac? Well, glutathione levels begin to decline in our mid-40s, and glutathione deficiency, or a glutathione deficiency, begins to develop. So most experts suggest that this is a good time to start supplementing with Glynac. The study showed that there were far greater benefits in older adults than in younger adults. And when they say older adults in the study, that meant age 61 to, or age of 61 to 80, to give you an idea what they mean by that, and younger adults, 21 to 40. I'm not sure why they left out that 20 years in between, right, for ages 40 to 60, but that gives you an idea what they mean by older adults and younger adults. How soon do the benefits start? According to the study, Glynac supplementation begins to improve age-associated declines within two weeks. 
<laughs> That's amazing. But a longer duration of supplementation is needed for a greater magnitude of improvement, which makes sense. How much should you take? Well, in this study, they used quite a bit, up to around 13 grams per day. Now, in doing the research for this video, I came across several doctors and other healthcare professionals who recommend taking about 1.5 to 3 grams daily. And this would be a one-to-one -one ratio, meaning 1.5 to to three grams of glycine and 1.5 to three grams of NAC each on an empty stomach. Now more studies are needed, but it's also suggested that the older you are, the more you may need to increase it. So I've been taking this uh, Glynax supplement right here from Do Not Age, and I've been taking one serving. One serving contains 600 milligrams of each. But after doing the research of this video, I'm planning to increase that dose to probably four servings, and that'll get me to about 2.4 grams of glycine and NAC, and I'm running out, so it's time for me to order some more. Speaking of that, if you wanna try it, I have a link for you down below so you can save some money. Now, another question is, what if I stop taking it? Now, this study also answers that question by saying our prior exploratory open label trial, meaning they're referring to another study, with a supplemented Glynac for 24 weeks and found similar benefits as reported in this trial. However, withdrawing Glynac for 12 weeks led to the loss or decrease of the benefits. So this data indicate that Glynac supplementation needs to be maintained for the preservation of benefits. So this is similar to the question, what if I stop exercising? You can't just go to the gym once and never go again. If you want the benefits to continue, well, you need to keep exercising. Here's another popular one. Can't I just take a glutathione supplement? And that's a great question. But the question shouldn't be, can you, but should you? Of course you can take a glutathione supplement. The problem is that glutathione supplements are unstable and most of it is not absorbed in the cells. To get around that, some very smart companies have developed something called liposomal glutathione. Now this version is stable and allows the glutathione to be directly absorbed by the cells. But let's not celebrate yet. The challenge is that each cell needs a different amount of glutathione, and that's variable, which means that it can change from time to time. So we used to think that we need to get rid of all oxidants completely, and that's why the term antioxidant has become so popular over time, very much talked about in a lot of different places. Antioxidants are, ex are extremely important. After all, we're talking about glutathione, right? The master antioxidant. But new research is showing that we actually need to have a delicate balance of antioxidants and oxidants, and we don't want to completely obliterate oxidants altogether. Your body has the built-in ability to regulate how much glutathione is sent to what cells and when, and therefore or preserve that balance. If you bypass that process, then you can create an imbalance in your cells and actually accelerate aging through something called reductive stress. So, unless your doctor is prescribing a liposomal glutathione supplement for some specific reason, it's good just to avoid them altogether. Which takes us to another very important question, which we need to know the answer to. Is taking Glynac safe? They also talk about that as well in this study. The RCT randomized, or the randomized controlled trial provides proof of concept that Glynac supplementation represents a novel, simple, safe, and effective nutritional approach in humans to promote and improve healthy aging. In addition, participants did not report any adverse events related to the use of supplements, Glynac or placebo, during the trial. So in this study, they say it's safe, and if you want to learn more about Glynac, be sure to check out this video right over here.